Hey y'all, so I have been living with the Joy Huggable Hangers for two years now, so it's time to update you on how much I have liked having them in my closet. If you watched my first video, I redid my whole closet. I basically took everything out, put them on Joy Huggable Hangers, put everything back. If you haven't watched it, it's on my channel. Go watch it, it's amazing. Um, I love these hangers. Um, Basically, I redid the whole closet. I ended up needing to buy more hangers because I didn't have enough because they gave me so much space and I have a lot of clothing. So it was really cool to be able to get everything in the closet. Um, as you can see, there's still some space. I have room to kind of push things aside. The only downside is you can't really do pants hangers and skirt hangers flat because they need the clips. Um, I know that I can fold pants over some of the, this style with the bottom piece. I've done some of that, but my skirts, I don't like to fold my skirts. So there's a couple of those in there. They don't fit great. Eh, you know, they take up quite a bit of space, but I am going to re <laughs> I am going to overhaul my closet again. Cause I realized, um, if you see, there's a lot of clothes that I'm not wearing. I don't know if you guys remember, but I turned some of them backwards. Right. And then when I wear it, I turn it the other way. I turn it the right way. So I can see all these ones that are backwards, I haven't worn in a year. So I did it in the beginning of, I think, spring. I turn them all backwards. I wear everything for a whole season. And then next spring, I see what I haven't worn over the last year. So anything that's still backwards, I reevaluate. Am I gonna keep it? Am I gonna wear it? I haven't worn it in a year, probably not gonna wear it. So I'm gonna go through and get rid of a bunch of things. I'm gonna sell them online or maybe the consignment shop. But the hangers have been awesome so if you don't know what a joy huggable hanger is we're gonna let's just review really fast so the hangers are very thin and they have a velvet coating on them so that way your clothes don't fall off and it prevents hanger bump so if you hang the clothes the right way you won't get hanger bump in your shirts you can even hang sweaters on them if you're strategic about how you um, squish the shoulder on here they won't give you hanger bump so far i haven't had a hanger bump and this has been two years of hanging my t-shirts and um, some sweaters. If you can see up there, I have my sweaters actually in bins and some are on the dr in the shelves over here. But I have hung a couple of um, sweater or knits. Um, I have knits. Knits will get hanger bumps super easy. Um, I did have to buy, like I said, more, which was great because then I was able to just redo the whole thing. I also did the coat closet downstairs. I tried to convince my husband, but he doesn't need as much space as I do. He has lots of stuff, but it all fits on his side because he just hangs shirts. Everything else of his goes in a drawer, right? I got a lot of shirts and skirts and dresses and whatever, and they, they need hung and they can't go in the drawer. So I needed more space. Um, I will say the one thing that I do find annoying is the velvet is good and bad. So it keeps your things on the hanger, but it really keeps them on the hanger. So if you just go to like grab something, you can't just like pull it off, you know, like you'll do, my husband will do that. He'll just grab it on his side because he's got plastic hangers. You just pull it off and it comes off so that you do have to take like an extra second to like pull your clothes off and put your clothes on, but it keeps your clothes sitting so much nicer. Like I said, you don't get the hanger bump. Um, other than that, I mean, I've loved, I've loved the hangers. I did buy an off brand. Um, if you see the white one, the cream colored one, I bought some off brand ones. They don't fit as well. Um, the hook part isn't the same as the joy ones. I was trying to see if I could show you like if you look. So like this part is nice, but it's real small. And my bat, my bedroom thing, whatever you call that, the hanger bar, um, is extra big because the contractor who did it, like decided to use like a stair railing. So it's huge for some reason. So luckily the regular joy hangers fit this one kind of like, you have to jam it on there a little bit. Like it doesn't quite go. Um, so I will say that for the hangers too, that the hook part is much bigger um, and it's nice, so it'll fit on pretty much anything. Um, other than that, I mean, they're, I can't rave enough about how much it gave me space in my closet and made it easier to like redo and just have it all in one place. Um, it goes all the way back to here. So like on the other side and then all the way, cause you can see my closet door takes up quite a bit of space, but I have the huggable hangers in all the way down. Um, she does make um, a lot of like colors. I know you can get them in black and purple. I think they come in like a blue. You can look online. I got mine at Target. 
it's been a while. I haven't needed to buy them because that's it. I, they, I got them. I fixed the closet and it's been awesome. So um, if you have questions, feel free to message me. Um, my tips are, if you're going to do this to your closet, take everything out in a big pile. That's what I did. I just took it all out in a pile and I had the hangers in a box and I looked and I checked everything as I put it in because that's the same thing. You go through the closet, kind of get rid of things you're not wearing and it just gives you so much more space. Um, so that's it. I can't rave enough about how much the joy hangers really have just fixed my overall closet space. Um, I love them. I'm going to not buy another hanger. Joy hangers is it. That's it. I'm a, I'm a believer. They, like I said, this closet, my coat closet, donezo. Um, yeah, leave me a message or comment. If you have questions, I'll try to answer as best I can. I hope this was helpful. I hope you learned something about the joy hangers. Like I said, if you didn't watch my first video, go watch that one. That is like redoing my closet or something with the joy huggable hangers because it shows you what it used to look like and then what it became. It transformed, which has just been amazing. So now I got to work on the storage on the bottom because <laughs> there's just piles of shoes and things. So now I got to figure out a better storage solution for that. So that's it. I hope you guys are having an awesome day and I'll talk to you later.